hi everyone and welcome back to my channel so today I have a fun little unboxing haul for you guys from Ulta some of them are things that I've already tried out and just needed to repurchase but there are three things in here that I'm really excited about because they are new I wanted to show you guys my first impression of unboxing them so I already opened up the box obviously but I have not opened up any of the packages yet so we're going to go ahead and do that on camera all right, so it looks like I got two little sample things. The first one being Benefit Boing, um, I guess a little concealer sample. And then this is Estee Lauder. Looks like there's two things in here. So something with Estee Lauder and like a L'Oreal coupon or something. So we'll look at that at the end. All right, so I'm going to start with the things that I already have used before and um, I'm trying out again. This is actually, I use the Clinique Dramatically Moisturizing Lotion every day as my daily moisturizer, but I recently went to Ulta and tried out the gel, just tested it on my hand, and it felt so much better than the lotion. So I decided to repurchase this um, in the gel form this time instead of getting the lotion again. And yeah, I'm really excited about it. It's just my favorite moisturizer and the gel feels really, really good on my face. So. I got that and then I think it came with a free sample of liquid facial soap, so that's pretty cool. And then I didn't know, maybe this is like super recent, but I haven't shopped online at Ulta in a really long time, but they sell MAC stuff now. So I was like, that's awesome because the reason I bought this stuff is because I had a really good coupon from Ulta um, on my email. So I decided just to go and get things that I really needed because it was cheaper. So I found out that they had MAC on there. So this is the powder that I used to use all the time, but I haven't purchased it recently because it is kind of expensive. But since I had the coupon, I was like, why not? This is the MAC Studio Fix powder and I just love this stuff. This stuff is honestly just the best powder foundation. I got it in the shade NW15 in case you were wondering. Okay, so next we have the first new product that I'm trying out. This is the Pirates of the Caribbean Dead Man Tell No Tales by Lorac. This is the cheek palette. I believe it has highlighters and like bronzers in it and the colors looked so pretty online and I just so excited. I was torn between getting this and then the Smashbox Casey Holmes, like uh, I think it's called like Spotlight Palette or something like that. I swatched her palette in the store and it was so pretty, like super glittery. It was just amazing and I really wanted to get it, but it was so expensive for only three colors. So I saw this one and the colors looked really pretty, had great reviews, so I decided to try it and it comes with more than three colors. So, all right, so this is what the outside of the packaging looks like. So cute and just very different and I have no idea what this says on it. Something in another language that I don't speak. So let's go ahead and see. Oh my goodness. These are so pretty. They have like the sparkly shades and then like the mauvey pink shades, which I think will be beautiful for the cheeks. So let's go ahead and swatch some of these. Oh. Oh, oh. They're soft. Like, look at that. Oh my god, they're so soft. Wow, those are so, so pretty. Oh my god, I'm so excited for that. They're so pigmented. Oh my god, and they blend so pretty. The one I'm most excited about for in here is the Bold Spirit. It's like the purpley highlight down here. I don't have anything like that, and I think it's going to be so pretty. Wow, that is so pretty. I'm so excited about this palette. I'm so glad I purchased it. I can't remember if it was cheaper than the Smashbox palette or just the same price, but you get six colors, so you're already getting more of your money's worth for that. So I'm so happy about that and so excited to start using that. Yeah, I really have no idea how much that was. Okay, the next palette I have is an eyeshadow palette, and this is the Beauty and the Beast eyeshadow palette from The Rock. And oh my goodness, I have heard such great things about this. The colors were so pretty online, and I just cannot wait to see what it looks like. I actually haven't even seen the new Beauty and the Beast movie yet, and I've been dying to go do it, but I just haven't. This is so cute. This is like a book. It says, Tale as Old as Times on the front. The packaging is really, really big, so I wouldn't say this is the most convenient thing for traveling ever, but... If the colors are pretty, I don't even care. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Oh, it even has like a little like page marker, like a book would have, and then it has the mirror here on the side, and then all the colors are here on the right. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Oh, I need to try some of these, okay. And like all the shades in each line go really well together, so each line could be like its own look in itself. Of course it comes with a cute little brush and I'm gonna use that to swatch it because my fingers are already so glittery. All right, let's try. Wow, Real You is gorgeous. It's like a pink shimmery color. These are so pretty. Yeah, I'm like definitely really excited about this. So basically you can use them as eyeshadows, um, highlighters, or like lining your um, top and bottom lash line. They can be used wet or dry. And they're so pretty and so pigmented. If you have yet to like be able to swatch any of these colors or try them out, just look at the palette. It's so pretty. Okay, so the last thing that I have in here is what I was most excited about seeing come out and purchasing, and that is the Naked Heat Palette. I love the Naked Palettes. I actually have, I have the second one, the third one, and the Smoky Palette. I don't have the first one, but I have the other ones. So when I saw that this was coming out, I was like, yes, please. The colors are gorgeous, and it just looks so different and cool. And the packaging, oh, this is so cool. It comes in like this little box. 
look how pretty that is oh my god okay let's go ahead and see <sighs> so pretty these are all like the mauvey like warm tone that i have been into recently and they're just so pretty and oh my goodness oh my goodness i cannot wait these are like literally i will wear all these shades like sometimes in palettes like this there'll be like one or two shades that i don't think i'd really wear that much I could definitely see myself wearing every single one of these. They're so pretty and perfect. All right, let's see here. They're so pigmented. Yeah, everything about this palette is just perfection. Love it. So happy about that. So excited to get to try out all those colors and wear them. And that is everything for my haul. I know it wasn't super big or anything, but I just had those three palettes. I really wanted to show you guys my first impression and get to open them up with you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye!